Tonight's the beginning of our high school football series as Peters Township travels to Bethel Park. But Bethel Park's quarterback has already done something that everyone should be cheering. Rick Dayton reports. Even at a young age, it was apparent Anthony Chickett's future would revolve around athletics. We had a little tykes basketball hoop out in the backyard and he'd grab a basketball and just start shooting hoops and dad, let's go catch baseball. Dad, let's throw a football. Dad, let's go hit golf balls. Let's and that's all he did. Anthony didn't just play sports growing up, he excelled. That success carried into high school, where he became the starting quarterback at Bethel Park as a sophomore. But one day, after basketball practice his junior year, he noticed a lump on his shoulder. You know, let's we have to get that looked at. He says, Well, I can't tomorrow, we got a game. It's our last conference game. Wednesday we have practice and I have baseball practice. So after that, I'll meet you at Med Express in Mount Lebanon. Doctors realized something was very wrong. They sent him directly to Children's Hospital for a biopsy. A few days later, they received word. And uh, we got the call. On that call, the Chickets found out their son had stage four Hodgkin's lymphoma. Matt and Kelly understandably shaken, but Anthony put them at ease. Once they finally told me, uh, you know, I was I didn't cry or anything like my parents told me they sat me down like right there on the couch and uh, you know they were breaking down in tears and everything and I was just kind of normal and I just told them I'd be fine and you know, everything will be okay. Anthony immediately started chemotherapy which caused extreme nausea and weight loss. More drastically it changed his appearance. The first time like, I really realized it was I was actually taking the SAT and uh, like I was wearing a hat and like I was taking my test and I just looked to my left and on the ground and there's just hair like all over the desk, all over the ground. You know, I would just try and like kick it away so like no one would notice or anything. Through it all, he continued to play. He started nearly every baseball game this past spring despite chemotherapy that ravaged his body. He underwent surgery to completely remove the mass in his chest this summer and after that surgery, the Chickets got another call, this one declaring Anthony cancer free. It just took a big relief off my back, you know, having to worry about it. You know, it definitely keeps me clear minded now. I'm, I haven't really thought about it since then. Anthony has resumed his role as a starting quarterback at Bethel Park. He's led the Blackhawks into first place in the conference and a berth in the upcoming playoffs. While his parents are happy to see him competing at full strength, they're even more happy knowing their son can handle anything life could throw his way. You know that there'll never be anything he can't handle. And as a parent, it's wonderful to know because one day you won't be here and you know that he'll be able to take care of himself and handle anything that came to him.